guys. Uh, so here's a scenario. You're on a ship in Singapore and you don't have a stinger or a, or a, a sling single leg, you know. So uh, stinger, sling, single leg is one of these. Uh, it generally goes here between the hook and the load there. So it can be a two-legged sling with one of those uh, hooked up or it can be a purpose-made uh, single uh, sling or stinger, we like to call them, let's see. Um, I have heard them called different things, but I'll just call them a stinger for today. All right, so what we need to do is we need to lift these stores off the back of a truck. So um, the captain's on your hammer, the, the store's truck's rocked up, he's told you 3,000 kilograms, you're all working it out more like 5,000 kilograms because you count the pallets on there, four pallets of water, there's the, the laundry, the chief engineer's new TV and the chief steward's uh, Christmas hamper. Um, so you've calculated more like 5,000 kilograms uh, and you've got to get some um, lifting gear from somewhere else. You've got a company vessel next door to you and you've got a Norwegian vessel on the other side. So you're going to ask the company vessel first um, and the providors there, when you ask, oh, we must go, captain's in your ear. So you're about to tell them all the bell that where the sun don't shine, but you remember your $2.50 Crazy Clark's calculator. Uh, and start the process of trying to um, borrow some slings off the vessels. All right, so the way we work out the safety factor for chain, right? So chain safety factor equals 0.4 times 80 equals 32. All right, so 5,000 kilos divided by 32 equals 156.25. And if we square root that, we get 12.5. Uh, 12.5 millimeter chain, yeah, it doesn't really exist unless you have it specially made, so we'll round that up to 13 millimeter chain. So. Uh, we'll give them another option though. We're going to ask them, hey, you know, have you got some chain or some slings so they don't keep running back and forth to their bosun store? Flexible steel wire rope has a safety factor of eight. You don't have to calculate it because it doesn't come in like the grade of chain, different grades. So, safe, uh, flexible steel wire, wire rope safety factor is eight. 5,000 divided by eight equals 625. And the square root of 625 is 25. Uh, 25 millimeter. So that's quite large flexible steel wire rope. I don't even know if that exists. It'd probably be 26 millimeter. All right, so you ask the company vessel next to you, have you got any of those size slings? Uh, or, you know, a two legged sling or a stinger or whatever? No, they don't. All right, so you ask the noggies, hey, noggies, they've got everything. Um, oh, yeah, we have, but we've only got the 100 grade chain, you know, so we'll work on a 100 grade chain. So um, safety factor for 100 grade, 0.4 times 100 equals 40. 5,000 divided by 40 equals 125. 125, make a minute, one, two, five. Square root 125, and that equals 11.803. But we're gonna round that up to 12 millimeter. And that would be more like uh, 13 millimetre rope. Well, that's the answer there, but uh, you'd have to say to them, have you got anything larger than, um, than uh, 12 millimetre? And they would probably say, yeah, yeah, we've got some 13. So that's the way you work out uh, what size sling, uh, or a single leg sling or stinger that you need to put in here uh, to lift that safely. Why would you have one of these? Maybe you need a bit more length to put it down the store's hatch or something like that. All right, so pretty easy equation, uh, but it pays to remember it and practice it a couple of times. You know, you, you do get um, paid as a, as a dogger or a rigger or a seaman, then um, you want to make sure that you can do something like this so you don't look like an idiot in front of the crane operator or, or, the, um, or other crews, you know what I mean? So you should really know this. All right, follow me for more recipes slash equations later.